Hey, I'm Alex Sweeney with Mac Tuts Plus, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install OS X Mountain Lion on a flash drive or SD card. So first things first, this tutorial is meant to be done after you've downloaded Mountain Lion, but before you've installed it. Here's why. If we open up our Finder and go to our Applications folder, you can see that before we've actually installed Mountain Lion, we have an installer application. This is what the Lion Disk Maker tool, which we'll be using later on in the tutorial, uses to actually create the flash drive or SD card. So once we've installed Mountain Lion, then that goes away. So it's crucial that we create the flash drive or SD card before we've in actually installed Mountain Lion, or else we won't be able to complete the tutorial. Next thing, we need a flash drive or SD card that's preferably exactly 8 gigabytes, but if it's a little bit more, we can work with that later on in the tutorial. So for me, I've got an SD card right in here, and you'll notice that it's actually blank. That's because I've backed up all the data to another drive because the disk does get completely erased during the installation of Mountain Lion to the drive. So just make sure that there's nothing that you actually want on the SD card or flash drive because it will get wiped during the tutorial. So now that we've gotten all that out of the way, if you meet all these requirements, then we can go and download Lion Disk Maker. Now the quickest way to actually do that is just to go to blog.get.net and click on Lion Disk Maker right up here. Uh, if you're in the US, as am I, I could just click on this and then you can download it and then use the application from there. So I've actually copied the application to my desktop to make the process a little bit faster. I'll just double click on it. Now it's going to ask us whether we want to install Lion or Mountain Lion. Now for us, we are obviously going to be choosing Mountain Lion, but the process for doing it with Lion is actually remarkably similar. Next thing is it's going to actually find the uh, install OS 10 Mountain Lion .app in our applications folder. However, if you have multiple copies of this on your disk for some reason, you can select to use another copy. But for most people, just press use this copy. Next is going to ask us whether we want to create a boot disk, which would be a USB thumb drive or an SD card, or burn a DVD. Now since I'm on a MacBook Air, and DVDs tend to be quite a bit slower, I'll choose create a boot disk. Next it's going to ask us how big the drive that we're using is. Now like I said before, I've actually got one that's exactly 8GB, but if you've got another kind of disk, you can click this button and follow, follow the steps from there. So for me, I'm just going to click an 8 gigabyte USB thumb drive. Now it's going to ask which drive I'd like to use. So for me, I've actually named my SD card, SD card. Now I'm just going to press choose this disk. Now once I press this button, Lion Disk Maker is actually going to go away and it's not going to give you any further information for a little while. So you might have actually thought the application crashed, but if you look in your dock you can actually see that it, it will still be running and as long as you see the icon in your dock then you know that you're good to go so I'll just press SD card and then press erase and then create the disk so from there the process takes over and it's completely automated now I'm going to press this button and then we'll be back and I'll show you what your finished product is and what you can do with it so we're back after around 45 minutes, but you can see that the finished product is well worth it. On my SD card, I've now got an install OS X Mountain Lion disk, which is fully bootable. Now what that means is, if you shut down your computer and hold down the option key when you restart it, you can actually use this disk to boot your computer from. Now the advantage that that's going to provide you is, number one, you've got a backup that doesn't rely on actually having Mountain Lion or Lion or any other version of OS X on your computer already. But in addition, you can actually, when you're in there, you can use Disk Utility to wipe your machine's hard drive and install Mountain Lion from scratch, which couldn't be done otherwise. So I'm Alex Rina for Mac Tuts Plus, and that's been how to put OS X Mountain Lion on a flash drive, SD card, or even a DVD.